Hello my loves, welcome back to another video on my page. Today this video is going to be about how to get this really deep blue, really dramatic, super big winged um, eyeliner look. My friend Carly and I are doing a collaboration look. Um, you might not know Carly, obviously, because you don't know me personally, but Carly and I went to college together. We had the same degree. Well, I have like three degrees, but... You know, we shared a degree, and um, we were really great friends through college, and we just happened to both share this huge love for makeup. And so she's kind of doing her makeup thing in California, and I'm kind of doing my makeup thing here in Kansas. And she texted me the other day, and she's like, let's do a collab. And I was like, yeah. So here's our collaboration. She, uh, We each picked out three pictures, and we decided we were going to do one of each person's picture. So... This is one of the looks that we're going to be doing, so let me zoom in for you. So it's a deep blue, really winged out liner look. Really big false lashes, I feel like a butterfly. Um, and you don't see any other part of the face except the eye, so everything I did is my interpretation of what I would do with the look. So I did more of a nude lip and um, a fresh cheek and some contouring, like I always do. So. Carly will be sending me her picture, um, and I'll put the links to her blog and her Facebook page because she is a blogger. I am kind of a YouTuber and a freelancer, so, and I do my own Facebook thing. So she is going to send, put my links up, and I'm going to put her links up. She's also on Instagram and Twitter, as am I. Um, so if you guys want to see any of the stuff that we post, go check out our uh, social media stuff and I am going to upload this now so you guys can learn how to get this look if this is something that you're interested in. If not, you can just admire it from afar and if you're not going to admire it, just don't say anything negative, you know what I'm saying? So, I'll see you guys in the next video and I love you. Keep watching if you want to see how to do this. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and find my Facebook page. Okay, I'll go now. <laughs> love you guys. Bye. Okay, and then I'm going to, um, I'm going to moisturize my face using my Garnier Moisture Rescue Gel Cream for dry skin. Looks like a gel. Surprise. Do I look like a million bucks right now? I feel like I do. Pause not. Do you guys get your nails done? I'm like really low maintenance and I'm super bad at making sure I do my nails. Um, but I have loving, I've been loving just to go get them um, shaped and painted. So I have totally been doing that. Um, I go to Envy Nails. Uh, there's one in Ottawa and there's one in Lawrence. And if I'm like up seeing Travis or something or somewhere out in Lawrence for some reason, I'll go and I'll get my nails done. So like this is what I got yesterday. And it'll last me like four days or whatever. And it's only like six bucks, so... I like it. Takes the stress off of me, but it's so it's low maintenance enough that when I'm done with it, I can just take it off and put on the next thing. Know what I'm saying? I'm gonna prime my face with my Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer, and this is in Color Correcting Balance. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to mix this CoverGirl Ready, Set, Gorgeous foundation. It's supposed to be a long-wearing foundation. It's just really light. Um, and then I'm also going to put some of my MAC Pro Longwear foundation on. Because this is just a little bit darker. I'm just going to take my Ashley Nelson buffing brush and buff it all in. To do my brows, I'm going to go into my Anastasia Brow Powder Duo in Dark Brown. And I'm going to take the darkest brown. And that's what I'm going to put first. I'm just taking this on an angled brush. Tarte Amazonian Clay, what is this, Waterproof Brown Mousse, and this is in Medium Brown. Okay. 
just a little bit of concealer on the back of my hand and I'm just going to go in and make sure I shape those brows really well. And then you're going to set your brows with the any kind of brow gel. I'm going to use Gimme Brow by Benefit and this is in light medium. I'm just going to brush my hair into place. So the first thing I'm going to do is set this brow bone and I'm going to use this palette right here from um, Wet n Wild. This is in Walking the Red Carpet and I'm going to use this white right here on a flat shader brush and I'm just going to set right underneath my brow and I'm going to kind of bring it down. You're going to want to load that up too. She has this color all under her brow and she brings it all the way down right here into this inner corner. This is a color tattoo by um, Maybelline and this is in Blue on Sky. Looks like that. So I'm just going to use my finger in there and I'm just going to press it. Oh, I didn't prime my eyes. That's okay. This will be enough primer. going to press it onto just about the crease right before the crease. I'm going to go into this Pacifica palette. I just picked it up at Target. Uh, it was like, what was it? It was like maybe $12.99. So I'm going to be mostly using this palette. And I'm going to start with this royal blue right here. I'm going to take a flat shader brush. This is the 239 by MAC. And I'm just going to pack it on this brush on both sides and make sure you're knocking off all that fallout and I'm bringing the shadow in that inner corner so that's what my base looks like take a big old fluffy brush and we're gonna blend out these edges this is a clean fluffy brush with nothing on it and we're just going to blend. There's that. Then I'm going to dip into this second color right here. It looks like she has like a, either a gray or a mauve color. Not a mauve, a taupe color. So I'm just going to go into this one on my fluffy brush, knock off the extra, and you're going to blend it right there. blue on the under eye, lined it on the bottom, so that's what I'm going to do. Okay, and then I'm going to clean up underneath my eyes. So I'm going to use my Pre MAC Pro Longwear Concealer, just get a little bit more. I'm going to take it on my finger and just start putting it underneath my eye. Alright, I'm going to set my face using my Stay Matte by Rimmel, and this is in 011 Creamy Natural. I'm going to set my under eyes with my e.l.f. Under Eye High Definition Setting Powder. Contour using my Chocolate Soleil in medium deep. It's matte bronzer. I'm taking it on a Stila 24 brush. For my blush, I'm going to use this Maybelline Master Highlight Blush thing. Looks like this. And this is in 20 Pink Rose. For my highlight, I'm going to use my 
I'm going to use my Hard Candy Blush Crush Baked Blush in 127 Honeymoon. For my liner, I'm going to use my Maybelline Line Stiletto Precision Ultimate Precision Liquid Eyeliner. Just going to give it a little shaky shake. I'm going to take Zero by Urban Decay and I'm going to put this in my waterline. I'm going to use the Maybelline Rocket Express Mascara. Just give a nice quick layer on my lashes. So the lashes I'm going to use are the Salon Perfect Demi Wispy lashes like this. This lady has like a really nice full pair of lashes. So I'm going to use the ones she's using. Just put a thin strip of glue on your lashes. And then I'm going to let it get tacky and then I'll glue it on. So you plop it in the middle, and then you stick your ends down. Okay, so the lipstick I'm going to use is 240 by Ulta. It's kind of a brown nude. Put that on. And then you can go over it with any really nude lipstick that you have. I have this like white looking one by MAC, so it's one of the Sheen Supreme ones. This is my finished recreation of that look. So this is what it looks like. I hope you like it. I hope you're daring enough to wear this look out because I'm totally not. I have to go to class like this. I'm a little bit nervous. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. If you guys have any pictures you want me to attempt to recreate, um, I would love it if you sent it my way. And thank you as always for watching my video, and I'll see you in the next one. I love you guys. Bye.